along the river, have a coffee. Oh, are you joining us now, Frank? I'm just talking about the Tamar weekend. I'm trying to twist Frank's arm. Um, so he's going to come and eat a Bifana into the microphone now. He's a class act. And he's going to put Bifana juice all over my equipment. You, oh, here he is. Oh, that, shit. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Right off the get-go. Foul language, uh, courtesy of Frank from the Algarve. Out of your out of your native habitat, your, your normal habitat, Absolutely. you can put your hat back on now if you want, I over can. the headphones. It's, May it's I? probably quite a good May look. I? Is, How is, is, are you okay? Look? Have you're you not... been through passport control of central Portugal yet? They tried. Right, they and tried what did you say? Hard. I'm from the Algarve. Yeah, Do you not I, know I, who I, I am? Do you know who I am? I'm a celebrity <laughs> back home. Right. You can't be doing this to me. And you know what? As far as the cavity check is concerned, it's a bit oh, yeah. excessive. You'll come again. Yeah, uh, uh, yes, <laughs> literally. Uh, can you please not do that? <laughs> Hi, Frank from the OLP. How are you doing? Uh, what am I eating? Could you describe in some detail? You know what? And maybe this not is, eat it this so, is, quite this so is, loudly. This is not. This is if this is not the most orgasmic bit of um, Portugal of of Portugal. Life? Then I don't know what else is, right. Carol Munson. Right. I Tell have, us. Talk into the microphone. Come on, you know better than this. You're a professional. I know, I know. I'm a professional. I'm trying. I'm trying really, really hard with you. All right. Okay. Pity so, me. Look, can I just all, say, if, if everybody could spare me a thought, me and Frank are sharing a twin room tonight. Yes. I'm so not looking forward he to that. He is so looking forward I'm to so it. Ladies and gentlemen, forward. please don't do this. You know what? He's so looking forward to it. Inside, I'm so not looking there forward. is a bumbling thing inside what? of him where he feels that there is going to be there is going to be some good fun had today. And you know what? All your perverts, sleeping. it's none of that. Sleep. It's going to be a lot of fl <laughs> sleeping. <laughs> we're going to share midnight stories. Oh, right? he... Is that what we're going to do? <laughs> I don't know. I think that's what's going to happen. Okay, all right. So tell me about this. Uh, we, we're having questions here. People are pleased to see you, Frank. Oh, well, thank you so very much. Is, is here to see you uh, right. on the screen here. Um, and Nubian. Hola, Frank. All right. Uh, hi, How Frank. How are you doing? Yeah. LP. And what am I eating? I'm not eating anything yet. However, Frank yes. did bring me one of these. What have you got? Can you go through it first? I've got, this is a world famous Bifana. Here is your camera. And uh, if you can see it on my camera. You yeah. see, Shall this, I hold it? A, I'll hold mine up to the camera. If you, you, you could, carry please. On. Yeah, you if carry you on. could, please. Because the thing is, this is what a Bifana should look like. And usually. Oh, you approve. It, and I do approve. And the reason why I do approve is look at the <laughs> look size at of it. Look at the size of it. Yes. And on top of that, there's grilled onions, uh, sautéed onions on top of it. Um, is that, that's a bit unusual, isn't that, it? Uh, that, that's not. This is actually, I've seen this happen uh, quite a few places. That's not uh, strictly around orthodox, here. Then, it's, is it? It's not. Uh, and this is why this is out of this world kind of bifana. Oh Once goodness. you eat it. Yeah. I've got to take a photo of that before I eat it. You I mean, absolutely should be taking a photo at, of look it. Look at that. The lighting's not perfect to capture it's not, that. It's not. But it is, it is it's a beautiful bad. Bifana. What is right about it is the and, mustard, right? And then, ladies and gentlemen, over there, what we've got, I don't know if you can see the grill, uh, they've got some bratwurst happening. And then, uh, like Oktoberfest. The Oktoberfest thing. Yeah. And then, on top of everything else, they've got like a homemade kind of a pork patty and a hamburger patty like uh, peter wilton davies actually went over overboard with yeah. everything and then on top of everything he's he tells me it, right? oh he, absolutely pwd, he, uh, PWD. Uh, like, you know i'm thinking to myself okay frank's here he's arrived in castino de Ferro. he's made his way to pete wilton davies and um, let me guess, your big buddy's BFFs now because he's the man with the we burgers are, and the We beers. are, we are, we are, we are, we were, we were, we were very close to making out right before you called me over. <laughs> Sorry, I disturbed you. Yeah, it's right. like you know, this is all kinds of romance you're killing today, Karen Munson. Well, we share a twin tonight. Thank you so you very much. You better not much. bring Pete. <laughs> yeah, I, if I bring Pete, then this will be, <laughs> then this will be something we'll have to do another show about. So you've got. Bratwurst, burgers, absolutely. Bifanas. Yes, sir. Does every all the food here have to begin with B? Be beer, bifanas. Bifana. <laughs> what else are yes. we allowed? And and, 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 de and here's the thing. I was telling I was telling young Benny Austin just now. Ben begins with B. A bit B. Right. I was just telling him that you know what the first three items have meat in it. The last two have vegetables in it. This is what turns you into a woman. Don't eat that. Eat the first three. You've just lost us half our audience. Yeah, exactly. Sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm being I'm being dared by Nubianet to take a bite. I'm going in. Can you keep talking? Well, absolutely. I can... So what happens is when you eat something like this, first of all, the cut off uh, the um, bifana is so different and it's so tender. 
I have not had a bifana like this before, and it's being grilled. It's not as if it's being put in like you know that soupy mm. kind of liquid the marinade, in the marinade, and it's being cooked in it. It's being grilled, so he's just marinated it. PWD did a very good job. I approved of it. I looked at him and I said, you know what, you're a rock star, buddy. Should we zoom in a little bit to the grill over there? We should. We should. Zoom did in. you find out who the hardworking man is? Who's behind the grill? It's though. always it's always the hardworking man who's looking for the credit and never gets it. So, oh, look at him, that poor guy. He's really, really working very, very hard for our goods. Bless him. And this is the wonder of Portugal when you when you do these small, small festivals mm -hmm. where you've got the beer, you can have your wine, uh, mm. you can have your your, your you can have your you can have your bafana. You can have your bratwurst. You can have your sausage. You can have everything. I am so having my bifana right yes, now. Yes, you should. You should be having your bifana because this is the way to do in Portugal. Mm. And after this, uh, I, I I really want to try the bratwurst, and uh, maybe the hamburger later. What is this? This is uh, vinho tinto. Why are you drinking wine suddenly? It's because I tried all the other beers. I'm going to go back. <laughs> I tried all the beers because here's the thing. You made your don't, first pass. Don't 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 laugh at me, Carl Munson. Why, I tried. Why not? I, I tried. I tried. I tried a beer which was frambuesa. So I seriously. Yeah. So I handed it to a lady. Yeah. I said, it you does, know, it does. I mean, without wanting to sound like a sexist relic. Yeah. A, a strawberry beer does sound a little bit. You know. Yeah. I mean this generically. I don't mean it in a gender said, or sexist. And, and I just handed her a glass, and she goes. Okay, I go a framboise, a bravo say, and and then she felt like you couldn't it was cope, my gift. You couldn't cope with having a strawberry beer. No, because I felt a bit strawberry right after drinking it. <laughs> I don't know what that feeling is, but I got it right after, and then I was just like, I That's think I'm going to a very very unfamiliar feeling. I, I was not very happy about okay, it. Okay, so you've gone from strawberry. This oh, I'm sharing. Uh, I'm just reminded again. I'm sharing a twin with you tonight. Yes. Thank you've you very gone, much. You've gone through all the beers already. Absolutely. Twice. You tried a Not strawberry twice. beer. Carl Munson, twice. And now you're on red wine. Yes, and red wine. Farners. Yes. It's uh, a good night. Okay. You know what? I'm going to tell you one thing. There's not going to be any snoring. And you, oh, I know, yeah, you know, your right. wife already told me you're a cuddler. There's no cuddling. <laughs> there's no cuddling. Right. None of that. No spooning. No spooning. <laughs> no spooning. There's, there's no like, Frank, I need it. No, I. Uh, yeah, I don't apply to those. Frank, needs. I'm scared. Yeah, I, I don't think Frank, I'm scared. And he said, what's I, that? I am now. What's what's that? A squirrel? No, <laughs> what? I'm not buying it. Um, okay, that's not a barbecue serving suggestion. Exactly. Not even in in. Um, okay, we've got. Um, I ca I can't mix beer and wine. Says T Duck. Who who does that? Right, T Duck. T Duck. Yeah. Come on, last well, night. Well, I can, but they don't stay mixed. And Nubianet, you are you are proving yourself to be quite legendary here and separating yourself from the pack. Uh, drinking beer and wine during the day mm. makes me sleepy. All I right. Mean, we're going to – How? what's our strategy here at the beer festival? And at this point, we should say to everybody, drink responsibly. Drink very even responsibly. Even if that's probably not what you're going to be doing today. No. Well, uh, what is your strategy for a beer festival? It does seem to me like you've peaked a bit early, if you don't mind me saying. If, if, if you can please go ahead and speak for yourself, that'd be great. Because <laughs> what I'm actually doing is I've gone and tried the beers, right? Yeah. All of them, except the strawberry and the... Oh, there, there's one beer with pina colada. Uh, obviously, Frank's not trying that one. Thank you be very careful. much. We now have a dog friend. All right, a dog friend. Who's looking he's, at my, coming, he's, who's, he's eyeing up your Bifana. I don't know. I don't know which Bifana of mine he's looking at, but he's looking at the one with with the sandwich. He is. So uh, this he is, is, this is the, not a good. He's waiting for you to get distracted. And he's a good guy. He's, he's really he's nice. Just, isn't he's just left he's us alone. Yeah. yeah. But he's, and gonna, he's a very he's good. He's made guy. a mental note of he's your Bifana. He's coming back. He has. When he thinks you're distracted. No, no, no. He's, he's. I'm looking at him. He's, he's got some mischief in his mind. He has. No, no, you, here he uh, comes. Get out of here, you. <laughs> get out of here, you. You and I will become friends later. Not now. Let me finish oh, this. He's, he's getting a bit. He's pushing back. Oh, no. He is pushing oh, no. back. He's pushing back. He's, he's like. A, he's, he's quite a, a, this one. Larry Geezer, isn't he? Yeah, this one. This uh, the, this one. He's got. He's got. Oh, he, there you he go. Like that. He's having some, a sniff. Oh no! Is he? And he's sniffing it. He's no fool, is he? He's no fool. He's like, all right, I'll, I'll take that I'll one. I'll take that. I'll take that. I'll oh, oh no, he drops it back. That. He's take. He's no. What is that? Is that a conquer or is no, it no, a, no. A, the end of a sausage? I actually believe. It might be hot. This it might man's be hot. A, this man's a connoisseur. 
Yes, he probably wanted mustard on it. He wanted mustard on it, and this guy just dropped it. Without uh, French mustard without, on it. Exactly. He, I he think put, it might uh, be hot. I've got a feeling it might be hot. No, I, 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 yeah, he's, 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 he's giving us all the gestures of hot sausage. You, or, you all see? the body language of hot sausage, yeah. yeah hot sausage. All right. It, it, In case it, you're wondering what you're watching, we are live uh, streaming from central Portugal. And that was a c central Portuguese dog. Ladies and gentlemen, we are live and we are from a beer festival, if you believe it or not. Yeah, and at the beer go. festival, I have actually done the first two rounds of yeah. the beers. And now I have moved uh, yeah, to the wine. What is, the, what, is, what is this a local wine? It's a local just... wine from right. Alcabasa. Is it? This is what the gentleman tells me inside. Okay, go cool. on. And that's why I said, you know what? I'd like to try some of this fine Alcabasa wine that you've that, got over here. That is interesting because on our way over here with young Ben Austin, yes. who is who is part of our uh, Good Morning Portugal wine club team, he brought us an amazing gin last month, or beginning of this month, and we're going to be looking at a gin, Ginja, Ginginha, and uh, Aguadent on Monday. He talks about this part of the country being renowned for its Baga grape, or it's part of the Baga grape Absolutely. growing tradition in Portugal. He didn't mention it. But why here, over here in Castelo de Pera would we be drinking an Alcabasa red? For some it's reason. It's a long way away from here. It is, it is a long way away, but uh, this is the beauty of Portugal, where right. every region based on the terra has its own taste. And okay. you can actually feel and taste the land when you drink the Garvola, wine over here Garvola, the, the keen-eyed among the gumpers will see garvo just going past there with linda yeah so you you, you think that's okay I mean, you don't think it should be a bit more local and uh, alcabasa some way we were drinking alcabasa wine last night weren't we we, the, were, we, we, Levada, we, we, we were last night but the thing is and i think they've got a brotherly connection a neighborly connection between one another well, they heard they heard about and they, and they exchange and they exchange wines and they were and then on top of everything else i actually believe they heard that Frank is here. Let's do yeah. something special. Chug that button. Uh, Chug yeah, it. I think you're getting the idea of what's going on here, T Duck. Uh, incidentally, T Duck, our executive producer, how does it sound? I think right today, um, setting things up, and uh, so much of that is down to you. So thank you so much, T Duck, for your help in uh, having this happen and, and supporting us so beautifully with this. Does it sound okay at your end? Uh, which regions are represented? T Duck, do you mean here in Castanera de Pera? It's local beer, isn't it, Frank? This is local beer. Made in Coimbra or? Uh, two of them are made in Coimbra. Yeah. One is uh, from around here, and one is, I, based on what I heard from PWD, Peter Wilton <laughs> Davies. PWD, right. PWD my, yeah. my best brother from another movie. Yeah, okay. That's what we're doing have right a, now. Get a room, you two. Yes. I'll have we, a nice little nice yes, sleep exactly, on my own. Exactly, exactly, right, okay. exactly. He's invited me, but I said, no, I, I, no vacancy for you, PWD. There's a spooner with me today. <laughs> right. So, hold on a minute. Which regions are represented? Coimbra? Coimbra. And then you've got uh, one from Alcabasa and one from this region. Okay. And there's the, the Tutti Frutti one. Uh, the strawberry. Uh, the, the, the strawberry one. I think I'm going to try that. You, you know what? Sometimes you have very, very interesting ways of disappointing me, Carl Manson. <laughs> And this is one we'll of the ways the you, you, you get creative. Get behind the queue with Gilda. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> right. Because the thing is, uh, now he's going to try, ladies and gentlemen, he's going to try. Oh, come on. Like, we're here at a beer festival. I'm not asking he's, you to, like, he's change going to try, the He's going to try the Morango one, and then he's going to try. What was, what was the other one? Oh, by the way, there's the, um, what's that What's that drink? The coconut drink. Uh, the, the pina colada. The, pina colada. There's a pina colada well, beer. Were you not joking about that? Because I thought you were joking about I was about not joking. Colada. You should have the pina colada beer. Right. Okay. I actually want to watch you watch the drink, the pina colada beer, because this is going to make life right. very, very responsible for you. Well, this camera is great, isn't it? We're isn't going, it? We're zooming in. Yeah, zoom in. You, has anyone ever told you you look a bit like Will Smith? Have you ever had that? <laughs> no, it, it might be something to do. Is this, oh, don't be so upset. What's going on here? <laughs> I'm just saying. I swear to God, I have not slapped a single person in my life. <laughs> Why would you do that to me today? I don't mean, Out of all the days. Well, just because, oh, I see it. You're not going to slap me because I, I, I get it, I get it. You're not unhappy about the comparison. I'm not unhappy about the comparison. I'm from distancing myself violence. from physical violence. Hello, Botar. Hello, Botar. To the Bay. We're making new friends in Castaneda. Yes, yes. Amigos, no. Você é muito forte. 
He thought I think he thought you were Will Smith. Yes, I, I think for a second he. Oh, can you stop that? I think for a second he thought that I was trying to good be fun and he wanted to come and compliment hey, you, me. Good for you, young man. Warm weather brings flies. That it we does, have a fly it? problem this afternoon. We have, we have, but this is a good fly problem because these flies are not They've necessarily the bad uh, because they know they like their mustard, they like their beef. <laughs> You know, these flies are very friendly flies. Right. Let's please not insult the flies. They're a part of nature. And you know what? We've got amongst us, we've got some people who are tree hugging people. And they, the flies, okay. once they come in, they respect the flies. All right. Very good. Yeah. Now we've got questions for you. Please go in. ahead. And uh, feedback. <laughs> feedback on um, great comments. Thank you, everybody. Um, let's go back to Nubianet. I think Frank's trying to take bites of his Bifana between um, outbursts here. Uh, I think we all. I sure am. I think we answered You're which right. reasons, which regions are represented, not which reasons. Uh, Antonio F, hello. I'll never have a Bifana. Uh, Antonio F is here, incidentally. Uh, bon dia to you, Antonio. Thank you for being here. Uh, do you know Castaneda de Pera? And um, we have a Nubianette saying she won't be able to have a Bifana because she's got a pork intolerance. What might we suggest, or would you suggest, in the case of... You know what I would suggest? Nubinet? And you mustn't say, get over it. No, that's not very I, I will never do that. <laughs> right. I will never do that. I have a right. simple solution, Yeah. which is a common sense solution. Yes. And this that will come wait. to you Yeah. in a way where I am giving it to you because I believe that this will be flavor, yeah. and you will not miss anything. So the best way for you to avoid pork is just add some bacon to your diet. Okay, well, as a sort of homeopathic influence to build up, it is to build up it resistance. Is, it is because the thing is, bacon, I believe, has so many amazing nutrients uh, that you can just the a little bit of oil nutrients. Yes, of oh, course. Oh, come on! Absolutely, it's not about the nutrients. Uh, is it's it? about the nutrients. Okay, all right. and then and then you know what? On top of everything else, if you do bacon with a little bit of butter, man, you are in protein. Central Night, nightmare, you don't think nightmare so? of ladies and gentlemen, and dairy ladies and gentlemen, I will not, I will not steer you wrong. I will always steer you towards the path I am of truth. I'm going to go to a sensible answer from Antonio F. To yes, he's, o he's going to give you a tofu solution, which is completely wrong. If you might as well eat my sofa, you. If referring to pifanas, they're usually not sold in groceries because they should be made on the spot and in the moment, as the meat should be hot and warm. So the only, the only, actually, to be fair, um, Antonio, and forgive me for saying this, mm -hmm. uh, the uh, Mercadona or Mercadonalds, as we call it in our family, do, do quite a good Bifana. They do. But that it's kind of like the exception that proves the rule, isn't it? That they shouldn't be made and stored. They should but you've be made. Tried, you've just, Carl Manson, you've just tried uh, this grilled Bifana. Bifana yep. And please tell me if you feel it's a delicious. difference. It's delicious. It it's grilled. Delicious. No question. He's no marinated question. it in his special sauce. Yeah. Right? And yeah. this is not cream of anything. This is like a very good sauce. It's a reliable sauce that he tells me that he has marinated in. And, yeah. you know, he's done a very, very good job. Um, there is one issue on the sound, apparently, Frank, that you sound sober. So I don't know what happened there because that's, re that's really kind of um, ladies and gentlemen, changing reality. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm changing reality. I am, I, am, filter. I am out of my turf. I have to sound very, very sober. And I have to be sober because somebody over here has to steer the ship. Yeah, someone's got to be the grown up. Absolutely, here, right? absolutely. Okay. And at the end of the night, we are roommates. <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm actually looking after myself over here. It's self. It's India Rose, I think, right there. Rose. Um, Belgian beers right. use fruit as well. Yeah. It's been done from the beginning of humans making beer, Frank. Very, very good. And what's your point? A Nubinet is just, uh, she's giving you a bit of trouble this afternoon. Yeah, why is she? Why is she being, hey, Nubinet, why are you doing that to me, man? You and I, I thought how you much, were friends. How, I thought there was love between us. How much have you, how much would you pay for a bottle of silk and spice red blend? I don't even know what that is, Frank. Do you? What is, what is the, what is the silk and spice Hello, red blend? Hello, well done. This is my friend. This is my, this is my, this is my wonderful friend. Who is this? Is he a brewer? Yes, yes. No, is no, he he's, he's, not, he's not. He could be a brewer. He looks like one. Yes, he does look a hipster brewer. He, he? he looks like a hipster brewer, and he's a troublemaker. This guy. Um, <laughs> this one. And the way he's looking was, at you, I, you know, I, it's yeah, true. I know, I know, you know, I know. It's true. We were we were at the Bufana Central over there, <laughs> and he was telling me, and he was telling me, he goes, he goes, what are you, what are you doing over here? Yeah. What, what are you doing it's on a my good question? Tour? It's quite this a good guy, question. This guy right over here. Hola, what up? Which was there? Come on, Sajama. Tiago. Tiago yeah, is here with us, with, the, uh, with us now. Are you going to talk to us? Tiago. 
No, 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 no. Come on, Tiago. It's live. Yes, on the it's internet. live. Yeah, it's yeah, live. Yeah, We're doing yeah. a live broadcast. If you're wanted by Interpol in five yes, months, exactly. this is not a good place yeah, to uh, be. No, right uh, Tiago and, wants to be off the camera, but he wants to tell me. And too ugly for the. No, certainly no, not. Absolutely not. Certainly not. You can, stand, ladies... you can stand there, though, because that's blocking out the sun. From... Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. One. Absolutely. Red, please. Wine red. Yes, please. Uh, uh, any of these craft beers would be fantastic. Tiago is definitely our new best. Yeah, or, yeah. Perfect. Oh, thank you. Thank you, brother. Why, why it's, uh, there? Over here. Oh, I think we love, we're love. we in love with Tiago. We're in love with Tiago. He's a very good friend. And you know what? While I was doing that, he was your, guiding me through the thing. Your new BFF my PWD new, is My new here. BFF <laughs> PWD, PWD is PWD. in the house. Yes. He is in the house. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> and he's busy organizing. He wouldn't even give us the time of day. But then he's like pointing at me. And he's going, Frank, I love you too. And I was just like, yeah, you, we, we can't be together in one room tonight. News from Mo happen. Ward, Frank. <laughs> Lol, the slap, which I mean, I think means, yes, Frank does look a bit like Will Smith. What is, um, what is uh, Silk and Spice Red Blend? That sounds like a make it's a of rum. Con it's oh, a rum. I think not it's a, a rum. make of condoms. Yeah. Okay. It, I, it could be condoms. I bought it in the USA and curious... But I have, I don't know what silk and spice is. Sorry about that. Or no, it could be morango uh, uh, flavored condoms. <laughs> okay. Is that what you're on about? It's not what, uh, no, it's uh, OLP who's asking that. Oh. Please don't uh, uh, like you know credit the wrong people with the comments because that could really get them into a lot of trouble. And get, Absolutely. Get us in we can't do that. Um, Antonio, I've never been to uh, Castaneda de Pera. Um, so it is a treat ahead of you here. He he, pigs love me, uh, even though they are you're a bit intolerant to them, uh, Nubianet. I don't want to r ruin that relationship. Okay, so yeah, there's a an intolerance on a number of levels, but or perhaps a mutual respect. I don't know. Uh, Sarah Taylor, hello. We're being photographed here by. Do you know of the great Terence Austin from Brit yes. from British show business? The, the, the British show business and yeah, the I famous think, artist. I think he was in the Benny Hill show for, Absolutely. for some of the episodes. Before he took off those pork chops. Or yeah, after. And he was a floor manager on the Generation Game. And he absolutely was. <laughs> and he absolutely was. Yeah. He was. He was so wonderful. He was a key, and today yeah. I was asking him, remember, I was asking what happened to the pork chops. Uh, yep. And he lost the pork chops on yes. me. I, I don't understand Maybe how he did that. he's developed a pork intolerance as well. Um, Sarah Taylor is here, Frank. As Hello, well. Sarah. How are right. you doing? And uh, you can answer that in the chat, Sarah. I've had an amazing apricot beer. Apricot beer? Yes. All right. LLP has had an apricot beer. All right. Beer. How's the mangina? <laughs> it's lady who's saying Oh, that. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. sorry, sorry. Oh, LLP. I thought it was a dude. I'm sorry. Sorry, Tara. You're making... You've made some friends today. Yes. <laughs> and I suspect one or two... Uh, enemies as well. Yeah, no, I'm there's quite, no enemies. Quite we're unnecessarily. Quite we're unnecessarily. We're, we're kidding well. around. We're kidding around. You know what? It's a, it's not just because you're drinking an apricot beer does not immediately mean that you get a mangina. It will not happen immediately. Maybe a day or two. Apricot. Apricot beer. Apricot, you mean? Anyway, let's not go. All into, right. Let's not. You want to get into it? No, I don't we can get, get into, into that it. Right now. Uh, there's great beer in Portland. Absolutely, and, and they, have they do have a great beer tradition. No, no, in in Toronto we have Portland beer, okay. and uh, what is uh, I, I, I but they they, they have very good uh, Portland beer tradition. IPA, very good IPA. I can imagine Portland. Yeah, the hipsters of Portland making fantastic. Why beer. do you always pick on the hipsters? I'm not. Carl I don't Martin? mean it in a bad why, way. Talk why, of why do you always do that? This guy is a rock star. He is, isn't he? He's going he, to is, he is. He is. It was Bifana juice. Do you want to do you want to mainline that from the, no, no, from the no, Tupperware? I'm I'm, I'm 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 all right. I'll, I'll I'll deal with the soup. Do you want a, you could have um like a, a Bifana juice submarine in your craft beer? Well, they, they they could ferment that, couldn't they, and have a top notes of Bifana on a on a. Do you need the, Did you just drop something? Do we need the dog over here again? No, it's all right. Okay, so Tiago, can you bring me a beer as well? Obrigado. He, we just missed him. He came and brought him. He, he's a lovely fella. Lovely fella. Uh, beer, Bifana, and broadcasting. One the, thing, the one thing about Portugal, day, ladies yeah. and gentlemen, you have to understand one thing, is whenever you're at festivals or everywhere you you are, you first start with your worst Portuguese. Yeah. And then people say to you... Which some call my only yeah, Portuguese. Exactly. Yeah. And people say to you, can you please talk to me in English because I speak English? And you go, no, 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 I insist on speaking bad Portuguese. They go, no, 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 you're butchering my yeah, language. Yeah, that's right. And that's exactly what Tiago yeah, no. told me. Really? 
Okay, well, enough and he now, goes, yeah. He goes, he goes, I can be your friend, but can you stop speaking Portuguese? I go, all right, I'm going to stop. <laughs> well, you seem to have got the measure of exactly. each other. Oh, we're not alone with the condom flavour. Um, I thought Silk and Spice Red Blend was a flavoured condom. It really does sound like it. However, um, it is a Portuguese red wine. Uh, Silk and Spice, we don't know you that. Think so? Yep. Um, the OLP is telling us that. Uh, Garvo was also an archaeologist on Time Team. The Garvo, or another one. Um, I am looking forward to meeting Frank. Me too. I'm really, really looking forward to meeting all of you. We should arrange a meeting. I thought you meant... I thought you meant in some metaphysical, spiritual way. You were really looking forward to meeting yourself. Have you met me, Carl Monson? <laughs> okay. <laughs> There's nothing yeah. metaphysical. It's all physical <laughs> as far as I'm concerned. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going right. to arrange a very, very nice get-together. Well, meet Frank, like uh, meet, meet the Frank scenario well we could do that meet yeah. the frank and the thing is there's not there's going to be like well, the fun is like you're going to host one of these discovery weekends yes in i'm actually thinking about this uh, uh, and, uh thinking about it yes i am thinking your level about of it. commitment bothers my, me. my level my level of commitment is based on the guy who suggested it and now i'm like the guy's looking at me right now and staring at I'm me i'm going... thinking about <laughs> it no, no, no. I think it will be great to host uh, an amazing thing like that, a walkabout. Not a walkabout, more than a walkabout, right? Because after a while, it will not be a walkabout. It'll be a sitabout. And then after that, it will be a drinkabout, right? It'll be a complete pissabout. It'll be a complete uh, pissabout. Yes, I think. Uh, yeah. Glaucio D giving you the big Frank as well. You know what I mean? The one with all the uh, capital letters. Absolutely. That you get whenever any man cave guys are around you. Mm -hmm. Uh, I am so looking forward to meeting, meeting Frank. That was Sarah. Thank you, so Sarah. I, I think there's probably the Canadian connection that Absolutely. Sarah is talking about. Because Canadians are, Canadians are all good people, man. We like our festivals. Um, yeah, I think... Can you I, not... Can I, you no, not, no, no, no. I get, I get where you're going with that. But I do think the... I don't know. Maybe this is now not the time. You know, we're having a great time here at a beer festival. Mm -hmm. I think the people behind inviting the Nazi into the parliament... When you say they're all nice people, that that might that was a bit of a maybe a deviation from that normal niceness. Well, sometimes when to. you when you shut the window down, a few creeps come in. Uh, yes, okay. you're not you can't be leave, responsible let's, for let's, it. Let's leave that. Let's but, leave uh, that. I get, I get your point about Canadians. You know, mm. my my experience of Canadians is that they're very lovely, easygoing people. Very easygoing people. Yeah. And the thing is, you know, from time to time, when if somebody calls us American, we don't even mind. I've really noticed that. Yeah, we don't even mind. Uh, yeah, it's just it's it's just it's just like you know Welsh people or Scottish people being called British, or or New Zealanders being called Australian. They really don't mind, do they? We, no we, no we one seems we, to be no, too bothered we, about we, that. We don't it's mind. We, we usually welcome our 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 neighbours down south, yeah. and we usually say, "All right, well, you know what? We've got we've got a connection." Uh, and we've, we've, we've got a connection as far as border is concerned, so we can't be it, it, <laughs> taken it, away from it. It's an opportunity to embrace your inner American. Absolutely. Uh, some say Garvo never blinks, <laughs> that he roams around the woods at night foraging for Bifanas. No, what Garvo actually does is uh, you are right about his night adventures, but his night adventures include being naked. And um, hugging all the trees around because he's got uh, approximately. No, I, I've got to stop you there. I, I feel really bad about starting that rumor. You did not start that rumor, by the way. Did I not? No, you did not. Okay. We were having a conversation in Man Cave, and uh, I think it was started by uh, the Irish guy. Always blame the Irish. Okay. Uh, oh. Eugene can pick Eugene. that up. Okay, yeah, right. Eugene was like, do you do you hug trees around where you are? And then we were all like, yeah, he does. You know what? He's got 15 trees around him. Of yes. course he does. And he does it naked. And then we were all picturing him. Remember we sent that meme <laughs> with him like half naked behind. I do like, know. Oh, remember, remember that? that? Remember? Yes, I do. Exactly. That, yes. that oh, is I, exactly I, the meme I, we I, sent I, around. I'd, hoped, I'd forgotten that. But anyway. Yeah. Uh, Oregonians love in Portugal. Apparently you can get silk and spice red, red, red wine here. Yeah. Sorry. For some ten euros, silk and spice. That's an expensive you wine. Know, then, it isn't sounds it? a bit luxurious. Is that saffron in it too? I don't know. And then know. it can become Persian. Tell us more, OLP, about silk and spice. We're going to be here for a few more minutes, and then we'll we'll um, we'll take a rest, and we'll be back later on. Probably as night falls, right? And as night falls, because the thing is, we have to get into the environment and bring some people in from the environment who have enjoyed this festival, this beautiful festival. I want to talk to some of the brewers. I wish, I actually wish most of you people were over here, our friends, 
who are seeing this because it's a beautiful environment. It's it's small, it's compact, it's very intimate. It's it's not like how it's going to be tonight uh, between Carl and I, but it's actually a, a, a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful uh, area where we're sitting. And there's food, there's drink, there's everything going on. Uh, it's beautiful. Garvo. Dogs, kids, everything. It's all, all, all of life is here. All of it? life is here. Garvos are illegal in 12 United States. Uh, in 12 U.S. states. I can, I can imagine uh, yeah, that. that makes, I can imagine that. Makes, that. I'm surprised it's not I more. can imagine. I spoke uh, to the mayor of Al Viagra, and he's very, very close to doing the same in Al Viagra, <laughs> because, uh, first of all, when someone has the symbol of the blue pill right in front of his house... <laughs> symbol it, of the blue pill. There's Ben Austin. Did you see that? There's Ben about. Austin, yeah. the young Ben Austin over he's there. He's our co-host in Tamar on the yes, 14th and yes. 15th Young Ben October. Austin. More questions coming in for Frank. Yes. What part of the Algarve do you live in? I live in Portimao. I live in Western Algarve. And very, very soon... Uh, uh, Isn't that central this, this is the, it's, it's, Can we please not do central and whatever? Uh, central Algarve would Sorry. be... Will can be... we please not do geography? <laughs> I mean... Carl Munson, this is great uh, of you to acknowledge that I live close to central Algarve. Uh, but uh, technically, Albufera is uh, central Algarve. So, Albufera is central Algarve. I'm very close to Albufera. It's a small town called uh, Portimao. You may have heard of it. I have. Uh, and uh, it, it is the town where the action used to happen before Frank decided to move. So uh, uh, what, you, what you need to do is everyone needs to go towards uh, Tavira because that is the Hatton town. Because guess what? Frank is going to be there. That's, that, that's the scoop today then, isn't that it? That is the scoop. I'm giving the scoop to everyone. Frank is moving towards uh, Tavira. That is going to be the landing pad for the Frank. Awesome. Okay, so you heard it first here on the Good Morning Portugal live stream coming to you live. Uh, we've been on for nearly an hour, so we'll give it a rest uh, when we get up to the hour point. Um, and yeah, that's where you heard it first. Frank is moving from Portimao to, Portimao to, to uh, so yeah, the, yeah, but one, one, one of the things Eastern is... Eastern Algarve. Absolutely. Eastern Spanish Algarve, border. Very, Spanish border. And the nice fish, the nice tuna, uh, the nice tacos, uh, the nice, like, you know, everything else. It's, it's, uh, the, the area has its own charm. Canada is the Americas. Canada is the Americas. Says, Absolutely. Who says that? Uh, <laughs> Coach Turner here, is here as well. Obrigado. Look at this. Tiago is back. Tiago is back. He's rocking it. Thank you so Thiago, very much. Tiago, you've got fan mail here. Yeah, um, you've got you, you've got somebody women. Somebody was saying, yes, Tiago. Look, look, you somebody in California, Nubianet. Tiago, can bring me a beer as well. Obrigado. Yes, but, uh, yes. Not to California. That's pushing. In California, Nubianet is in California. Yeah. So I think we've got to go and hang out with Tiago. Tiago, now, Tiago you got star, star quality. I, yes, I saw it yeah. right from the beginning. As we were standing while the thing was getting barbecued, I was just like, this man's got star well, the quality. The thing was getting barbecued. Yes, yes. The Wonderful. Star, that's the star maker, Frank. Um, hey, boys, have one for me. Coach Turner! Fantastic. Coach Turner! Okay, there's actually, there's actually an airport in Thanks. Russia named after Garvo. Really? Um, Thank you, brother. And uh, you so last much. few comments then. Oh, Rugby Colin is going to be in Portimao in Tiago. Uh, Carlos. Carl. Oh, Carl. 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 No, I'm Carl. But I, yeah. in, in Portugal, it's Carlos. Oh, yeah. Carl, yeah. Good yeah. Brazil. Muito obrigado. Carl and Carl Frank. Frank. Carl and Frank. With our, with our, <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> with our new Brother, best mate. Thank you so, so very much. Jin -jin. Thank you so much. Thank you so very much. We'll be Muito with you obrigado. in just a moment, minute, Tiago. We're going to come and drink, have, have a drink. And, and I'm, I'm going to be hanging out with uh, Tiago. We both are going to hang out with we Tiago, are. and we're going to do it's the get, show. It's going to be complicated tonight, isn't it? Um, I don't know if think our twin room is going to be big enough. No, I don't room. think so. I, I, I think this is going we to need be... need to phone th ahead and get th this something. Is, this, is going to be, this is going to be a weird orgy of human <laughs> beings. Uh, but you know what, you perverts? Not it's, that kind of orgy. It's so not. It's, it's no, no, not, no, no. no. So I'm not. turning your microphone off. This is so not going to be a weird orgy of human beings. Everybody, I just want to make that clear right now. Okay, so Frank's back on now. Good oh, morning, exactly. Portugal. <laughs> opinion, on that, of, opinion on that wine. Intense and deep ruby color with a bright red halo. The predominant flavors are ripe and cooked black fruits. That's the uh, condom comparison wine there was it? yeah the silk, really? and, silk and spice so so the thing Sweet is so vanilla. you the, is the idea that you will not be drinking and you might be drinking 
I don't know where you're going with that. And actually, I don't want to know. Yeah. Sweet notes of vanilla and touches of mocha. Touches the, of the, mocha? Why? Oh, vanilla and mocha. She's living the Vida Mocha. She is. Uh, the first impression... The first, the first impression in the mouth is rich and full. Wow. Excellent balance between tannins Nubianet, and acidity. Yeah, Nubianet, no, it's not Nubianet. It Stop easy. it. Stop Who it. Is it? Antonio. It's Antonio. <laughs> with a long... Do you like a long and soft finish? I, I kind of do. I kind of do. I've, I realize that in I, life. And I, I'm just reading things out here. But don't you think life is about a long and soft finish? If you're lucky. If you are. You're, you're right. Lucky. You're right. You're right. And it's days like these very where we, where we drink to that, isn't yes, it? Here's to a long, soft finish, my a friend. Very, very beautiful, long, soft finish, you and I. <laughs> okay. Uh, please stop says commenting. My, says my roommate. We'll please be, uh, <laughs> have a prayer for me. Don't call me your roommate. <laughs> Frank Cooking School in Tavira. So is the Frank Cooking Project moving to Tavira? Absolutely it is. We are going to be doing a lot of cooking. We're going to be doing a lot of classes. We're going to be doing a lot of going to the farmer's market together. We're going to be exploring things. We're going to go to Spain. There is so much in play. Um, sadly, uh, is how I'm going to preface this next comment. Nostra, you see, he wanted to say Nostradamus, but he's actually put Nostradamus. <laughs> Nostrad Anus. Who is this? Actually, I like him already. <laughs> actually, predicted this event this? 500 years ago. T Duck, T Duck is back with some Nostrad Anus action. <laughs> and um, I will be in Portimao, says Rugby, T, uh, T Duck. It was T Duck. It was such a wonderful pleasure meeting you yesterday and your missus. It was wonderful. He says also another review of you is you're funnier in real life. Oh, yeah, he, he, even funnier in real life. Yes. How about it? I, I will be in Portimao 27th, 28th, and 29th, says Colin. You know Colin as well? No, I don't know Colin, but... Colin's can... got a room of cats. A, a room of cats. If you go to his cats, he might... If, you know, if, you go to, if you go to his house, he is might he, invite cat, you to the room of cats. Is he a cat breeder? Cat. He, he's a cat lover. No, a lover or a breeder? A lover. A lover, okay. Yeah. So how many cats in one room? How many cats in one room, Colin? He'll be in Portimao 27th, 28th, you and 29th. See, yeah, you October. see, Colin, I didn't even go there. He's good. Well done. Yeah. He's going to be going to the Auto Dome. Do you do? Do you go yeah, to yeah. the Auto Dome? We, we, we've got we've, we, we've got the Auto Dome, and we've got a horse right next to us right now, and um, this is wonderful. Dom Carlos. Oh, that's Carlos. the park, isn't it? That we met. Oh, is that the park? Yeah. Sarah's here as well. Now it's lovely. People, people from the the usual. Um, weekday morning community are joining us this Saturday afternoon. Thank you so very much for joining us. Fantastic. Hola, what y'all doing? Just stumbled in. We're in Castaneda de Pera at the uh, at the Cerveja na Aldea festival organized by Frank's new best mate. Yes, yes. What do you call PWD. him? PWD. 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 Please don't be calling him anything else. He gets very upset when you call him anything else. He's, <laughs> he's talked to me already. If you call him Peter Wilson Davies, he kind of gets easy. He's like, come on, man. He's I'm a like, legend. We're the, close. The, He's a legend. In the this guy, the, the guy. Somebody just calling me a parallel. What's that? Yeah, it's all right. That, it's me a club. I need to call me a because he actually knows I got a picture of the, um, of the wine uh, OLP. It's not downloading. We're on the cafe's Wi Fi here. Yes. So maybe we'll upload that at the next. Uh, session so we'll, we'll we'll take a break and we will be back um and i need to find out why i am being called that <laughs> we, 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 yeah. we, will, we will we will reset folks. oh he's not calling me that it's, it's a, it, it, when you send somebody a, a, like an instagram yeah. or a tiktok it takes the first line he's not calling me that he's I think not that's he's not calling he's not calling you that because you know, we, we'd find him right now what about nostrad anus yeah like that wasn't a mistake. That wasn't a mistake. <laughs> right, okay. um, it's because it's T-Duck. I don't think it was a mistake. We met him already. <laughs> I know okay. it's not a mistake with that man. Nostradamus was born in Saint-Rémy de Provence in France in 1503. And did he predict that Colin would have six cats and two dogs all named after cars? So finally then, <laughs> thank you very much, everybody. Right. For, for, for Colin, this is the first time in my life word? somebody's made me cough. If you were to name your eight pets after cars, what, what would you be calling them? Um, Escort? Escort. Cortina? Cortina. Uh, what else? Um, Porsche. But, Porsche. But, 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 Porsche's but, but, a nice name. But, 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 but Porsche's, uh, I think immediately she's going to be dancing. And then uh, it's going to be Shelby. Shelby. Um, then it's going to be, um, 
I'm thinking of names metro, here. Metro, mini metro. Metro, 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 very nice. Very central. Allegro would be Alle a nice Allegra. Name Allegra. Yeah. Allegra is going to be very, very nice. Yeah. And Mustang. Uh, Mustang. Mustang as well. All of those names. Good call. Six, it's six uh, cats, two dogs. Uh, you can uh, uh, Edsel. Is that a name? Is that a, a vehicle name? Edsel. What's that? Uh, a, a Ford uh, Edsel. No, uh, Edsel is a Brazilian name. Uh, can you please take it easy on the Brazilians? Okay, and maybe what about a, a, a dog called 190E, the best Mercedes that was ever made? We'll uh, leave that hanging yeah, there. We'll, we'll leave, leave that hanging. hanging. We, we, I've got a not, I've got we're a very, we're, to we're, we're, We've got we've got we've got a very human touch to everything. So the thing is, we who need to relate. Like, who doesn't like a human touch? Uh, on absolutely. A, when you're sharing a twin room, absolutely. On a Saturday especially, night, especially when someone who's reckoning to be my roommate is, and he's talking about human touch. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> thank save you a prayer. very much. If you're, if you're going to church today, save a prayer for me. Oh, apparently, you're, we're fact checking your Canadianness. Exactly. I don't believe Frank's really from Canada. No, I'm not. Not once has he said, "A" eh? or "hoser." Why would you say that? What is that? What does that mean? <laughs> well, who does hoser anymore? Who do, this is, is not Don Cherry's Don Cherry's hockey night hour. <laughs> What's wrong with you people? Who does hoser anymore? Well, we don't do hosers. There you go. <laughs> I think we settled it. Actually, um, you don't want. Uh, 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 Carl Munson, when yes. we're sitting down and we're having another drink, I'll yeah. tell you what hoser actually means. I don't think I can manage from. any more drink. But yes, anyway, let's go you see what be. let's go. Let's go see what we can do. You'll love it. All right. Cheers, Ray. Says the man who's got two drinks near him. Thank you. I have. I've got a queue here. Exactly. Um, thank you, everybody, for, for indulging you, us. Folks. And we'll see you soon. We're going we're gonna to pause the stream right there. <laughs> we 